welcome to another week at the Beaumonts. If this is the first time visiting the channel, please, hope you like this video. Please give us a like and subscribe and you'll get notifications of all the content. I upload every week and we do loads of, I'd say exciting stuff. It's mediocre stuff, we're all in lockdown, but you know, we're trying to find joy in the situation that we've got. So if you want some inspiration or you'd like to give me some inspiration, like, subscribe, comment, and let's get a little community of joy going, yay. It's time to take a look at the times this week that the postman brought me joy. In this week's Postman Brings Me Joy, there's two things. One of them I already opened. Sorry, couldn't wait. And it's this. This is a flat, foldable laundry basket. Now, you may not get excited by this. This kind of thing excites me. I've just used it for the first time to bring the laundry downstairs. And it's great because it'll pack up nice and small and go into my basket. But the reason I bought this was because this is my old one, my big pink one that you've probably seen sitting on the table in other vlogs. It's massive, um, so it always takes up space. Um, my house is quite compact, and also all the little hands are broken. Hands are broken because um, my kids used this as a boat in the paddling pool last year, and you know they're not little anymore, or they're not that little anymore, and this broke. But I haven't. I, I hate to throw things away, so I was thinking. This isn't really broke, I can still use it, but you know, life's too short to risk getting your hands and things cut. So, I got a perfect idea for this. This is going to be the Tadpole Graduation Pool. So, sometime over this weekend, maybe even today, I'm going to dig a nice little hole in the front garden and sink this in, cut all these sharp bits off and Pond number two will go in. So this is good news for me and the tadpoles. Uh, but the postman did bring something else today, which I haven't opened yet. And I'll show you now. So, post box. I think this was the Hermes man, actually. That was delivered by Royal Mail, even though I got it from Amazon. But this is the Hermes. And yeah, who gives a crap? Um, we'll donate 50% of our profits to help build toilets for those in need. Yay, you. So, um, I will put a, a link in the description to get these, but this is... Oh, I forgot I'd ordered them, so that's lovely. This is... Um, you know, just see where it Who gives a crap? Now, you may, may remember back, I think it was like the end of September, October last year, sorry. I've actually got to kneel down, I'm so short, that's never happened to me before. You may remember back in like September, October time when I did my first unboxing of um, Who Gives Crap? And um, basically that came then with six of these. I've just opened one and I've got one more left. So basically I've used four of these since October. So they come like this and I just think this we use these a lot we use these for tortoise accidents dog accidents chicken accidents mom and dad accidents kids accidents so we do use these a lot so um these are gonna last me so that's like six months that's already lasted me six months and I still got two left so I'll put them away in a bit um and also I ordered the dream cloths. So I ordered something similar from Amazon um, some time ago, which is these. Exactly the same thing really. Uh, rather than throw away cloths all the time, there's these. But these do look really disgusting even after I've washed them. So I will keep using, I mean these are brand, haven't been used at all. But the ones I have used, they don't come out particularly well. So I thought, well I'll buy these as well. A sponge and a paper towel had a dreamy Swedish cloth baby. That's how they uh, dries like a dream. Super soaker up there. Plastic free packaging. 100% biodegradable and compostable. Kapowia spills. So 50% of prof profits donated for toilets. Um, it holds 13 times its weight. Uh, you can reuse it over and over. Wash it in the machine or dishwasher and compostable. Clean freaks love this, and I quite like the patterns. And I think there's three, there's three different coloured 
patterns. So, yeah, that's my who gives a crap. And without further ado, let's go and check on the tadpoles. This is going to be quick because it's raining and I'm not sure this camera will like getting wet. There's the bowl filling up with nice rainwater ready. It's going to go somewhere there. And our tadpoles. Oh, they're all hiding from the rain. I saw some wigglies then. Now, yesterday when it was sunny, there was hundreds of them all on that rock. And now there's one or two. But what I really like is that the water's nice and clear. You can actually see the bottom now. Yeah, I'm confident that we'll have some nice little froggies very soon. So last week I did a little bit of a tidy up in here um, because it was getting just immense and all these drawers were full of stuff that I never use. So I went through all those and cleaned them up and I got rid of all the frames and the crap off the window. Bubble wrap. This came with the um, laundry basket today. Steve will use that. Maisie's having a little sleepies. You want mice? And this is my pile, currently, of toilet roll. And, yep, my toilet roll, um, one, one kitchen roll left, and one box of tissues. Now I have to make room for six more kitchen rolls, so let's get that done. So, while on a roll, with some tidying and getting things together, I decided to do my fridge. So, um, I, I'm i doing a shopping delivery today, so I thought, well, my fridge is quite empty. Perfect opportunity. There. I haven't done all the doors, which still maybe require a bit of sorting out, but I can't bother with that today. So I've sorted out all the drinks. That could really go in there. And yeah, so I've now got uh, my fridge almost ready. I've just washed, taken all the fruit out, washed the bottoms of the bowls, and hey, presto. So I try and, I mean, I've been quite thorough today. I've spent a good 10 to 15 minutes doing this. But what I try and do is, the day my shopping's due, is just spend a couple of minutes um, with my new dream cloth. Ah, it's my new dream cloth. Spend a couple of minutes cleaning up so it doesn't get too disgusting. The reason I was propelled to do this today was that um, Cole had put his soda stream in here and tipped it and this was getting stuck and I couldn't open it but yeah, now I can. Ta-da! All good. So that is a nice clean fridge reader ready for my food shop. So I'm home from a run. And there are two boxes waiting, so let's do an unboxing. Postman brings me joy, take one. Cool, are you ready to open box number one? Yeah. Oh, I'm gonna I'm gonna cut this side so the lighting's a bit better. Okay. Uh, uh, oh look! <laughs> there it is. Dope. Puddle. Ooh, 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 what is it called? I don't know, fudge. Fudge! There's a time to be sensible, but it's not today. So this is a stirred fudge box, and the flavours we've got are caramelised biscuit fudge, creamy sunny side up mallow, and macchiato, macchiato foam swirl fudge. Nice, so... Mine. Louis Moose. Well, you can all share, taste a bit of that. And cola Moose. Mm. Yeah, and that's stirred. So I took them up in their offer. That was £10 including delivery. So nice, num num, Easter, Easter special. Well, since you're down here, you might as well open this one for me as well, Cole. What could it be? Right, we have, ooh, I bought some notebooks for work. Creative juice. So they're lined paper. I did think they were ring bound and I thought they were hard, but so, but don't worry, don't wait for it to happen, make it happen. It's quite handy to have um, 
nice thin notebooks and plans for world domination. So I used a discount code for these um, and I'll have to check and I'll put in the here how much I paid for these but three notebooks for work because I was running out of stuff. Happy days and I have a, a packed coffee which uh, I probably won't use that. But yeah and this is from a company called Oh Dear. So yeah I do like them, they are quite nice. Great for work. I was running out of notepad paper, so I'm happy with those. Yeah, just not quite what I had in mind. But yeah, these will do the perfect job. It's gonna try a fudge. Fudge for breakfast. Uh -huh. Perfect. It's a, it's a like proper fudge like the shop in Tenby. Mm -hmm. Like when you see him making it. Mm -hmm. I thought you were gonna let me have a little taste then, but never mind. No. <laughs> never mind. Num num. Unboxing Amazon shopping. You feeling confident about that now, Cole? Mhm. Mm turn it around. Do it again. What do we have? Oh, what do we have? Ooh, protective gear. Um, da, da, da. Ooh, da, da. Squash! Yay! Real fruit Robinson squash and. Yes! How many bars? Twelve! Yay! Twelve bars! Oh, and what's this? What can it be? A box within a box. Syrup. I think you need to look inside. Oh, it's Yay! It's syrup on the box. Well, it is syrup. Not syrup, it's bottly syrup. It's syrup flavouring for the soda stream. Four, is it? Four bottles, yeah. Okay, bang them back in the box because we can store them in there. And you can put one in the fridge if you wanna. Have we got any of that left? No, right, okay. We can put oh, one in the fridge. The other can go in the utility room next to the gas cylinders. Right, on to box number two. Or technically number three, because that was box number two. There's a box in the box. Oh, Dad! That means to hang on, pause. That means to turn the oven off and get the food out so it can start cooling. And turn the beans off as well. Everything off. And bring the um bring the cottage pie out, Dad. Because it's time for us to watch the winter soldier. And let's have a look. How did our family cottage pie turn out today? Oh. 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 It's getting hot out. Ooh, bubbly. Ooh, yum, yum. There is our family cottage pie, which we're going to tuck into once it's no longer volcanic. While we watch the second episode of. What's it called, Cole? Yeah. Winter Soldier Dude. Falcon and the Winter Soldier. Yeah. Right, box two, let's go. Box two. Easter. I can see Piper! Oh! Oh! Helmet. A helmet. Ooh. Ooh! Now this is not me being extravagant, but Daddy-O had some money for leaving his job and this is what he chose to spend it on. So what do we have here, Dad? What's this? Um, brake cable and gear cable cutters. Fun stuff. So I don't wreck the end of the cables. Cool. A bit bigger than they looked on the picture. Yeah, they're quite big, aren't they? And I've got oh. chain... With free bubble wrap. Yeah, and free bubble wrap. Mas get. Master link pliers. Let's get out. Let's get out. It's open. Um, master link pliers. 
Mm. Awesome. You haven't got the um, thing other one yet. This is one. um this is for cold, but he doesn't know yet, so I'll be really quiet. And we'll bung that. Um. We haven't got the other one, we haven't got the um yeah, yeah, we're waiting waiting on another parcel. And that's it for today's vlog. I hope you enjoyed it and I hope you tune in next week because next week we have um, some time off. Easter is coming. I'm going to be making some Easter egg cheesecakes. Yay, for like everybody. And yeah, let the good times roll. See you next week. Stay safe. Stay safe. See you next week. Bye.